Okay, okay, great. Okay, hello everyone. I'm Anna Bassem, Bresales Engineer uh, from IT Pillar. Thank you for joining uh, this webinar. I hope this, inshallah, will be uh, useful for you. It won't take much of time. It's just 30 minutes. And so we uh, can start now. Our topic today will be an ununified identity access management solution to manage and secure digital identities. This will get through AD360. AD360, this solution from managed engine to achieve identity access management. Okay. Um, okay, uh, I just uh, make sure you can see uh, the webinar as full screen. Tell me. I'm well for screen now. Okay, great. Before starting the webinar, let me introduce IT Pillars. IT Pillars is a private company delivers ITIL and ITSM solutions. Since 2010, we have focusing on uh, delivery high quality services for medium and enterprise uh, clients in Saudi Arabia, like uh, El Marai, uh, STC, Ubaikan, Popa, and King Abdullah Medical City. Okay, this is our uh, services. We trust this managed engine gold partner in Saudi Arabia, and also we provide professional service from uh, the implementation and installation until the training and local support uh, for your company. So managed engine provides many solutions and uh, uh, product in different fields so we have like Active Directory, we have Help Desk, we have Desktop Central, Mobile Center, uh, Network, Server, Application, IT, uh, Security, and Analytics. All of these categories uh, include some solutions and tool to help you in IT management. In Active Directory, we have AD Manager Plus, we have AD Audit, uh, we have um, AD Self Service, and also we have AD 360, which is our topic for today. Also in Help Disk, we have a Service Disk Plus, we have Asset Management, uh, so Asset Explorer to achieve asset management. Also in Desktop or Unifying Endpoint Solution, we have uh, Endpoint Central. We can make many features in Endpoint Central, like a uh, batch deployment, a software update, and also uh, inventory. We have many features in desktop category. Also, we have uh, MDM in mobile category, OP management to monitor uh, your network in network category, and most of these solutions uh, available in two edition cloud and, uh, sorry, to uh, version cloud and on-premise version. I will stop sharing and share again. Just one minute. Okay, now I move from slide to another slide. You can see. Okay, thank you.
Okay, this is our agenda for today. Today we'll uh, discuss uh, overview about AD360. Also, we will uh, focusing in main points or highlights of AD360 and what is the main components for this solutions, which is AD Manager Plus, AD Audit, AD Self Service Plus, Exit Change Reporter Plus, M360 Manager Plus, Recovery Manager Plus, and SharePoint Manager Plus. So AD360, this solution from Manage Engine to achieve identity access management in Active Directory, in Microsoft 365, also Exchange servers and cloud application. So AD365 focusing in identity access management, which is uh, main features or uh, main functions is creating identities, securing your identities, auditing, deleting, and recovering your identities. And this is what exactly AD360 can make or achieves. Okay, this is the highlights of Manage Engine AD360 or the main functions for AD360. First, we have identity lifecycle management. Usually, um, any new employee face delays in gaining um, access to the IT system or any application or any another tasks like uh, any change in his information or edit or delete or any um, repetitive tasks that take a lot of time. So AD360 enables you to automate routine management tasks like create user, uh, moving this user to another group or uh, change any information and so on. So this automation to reduce uh, your time and effort. After that, we have self-service password management. You can give the users access to take action like, uh, for example, reset password, unlock account, edit or change any information. Also, we have multi-factor authentication, AD360 offering this multi-factor authentication for applications and also endpoint access. We have more than 19 different authentications functions. Uh, we will say this during the webinar, inshallah. Rule-based access control, you can enable non-admin user to take actions or tasks like um, uh, any change or any creating or any uh, policy you will access or take the the or make the technician uh, take this action so you can make a custom rule for every technician to make this action by help disk delegation okay also, we have single sign-on uh, for cloud and on-premises application. After that, we have approval workflow. So we can make an approval-based workflow to monitor um, the technician activities. So, so you can make a workflow for each specific uh, request, and you can make approve, or accept, or refuse for this workflow. Also here we have AD administration. You can manage Active Directory, uh, Microsoft 365, Exchange Mailbox with easy and simple way by AD360. Why? Because this offer for you to create bulk of users, change or edit a group uh, of users, GPOs, UOs, and also we have different type of management. We'll see this uh, during the session. We have identity automation. Uh, this is will decrease the workload sp uh, specifically with repetitive tasks by supporting automation. So you can make user lifecycle management for every uh, action in your Active Directory. Also, we have AD360 can get the data from the, your company on what users are doing across um, over uh, a long period 
and this is can detect what is the normal behavior and what is the unusual behavior so this is will be anomaly detection and the system will send you notification which is this is i uh, ai analytics so we have uh, more than uh, 200 uh, reports in ad360 and also we have ai analytics So all these features we talked about are achieved through this components. We have AD Manager Plus, AD Audit Plus, AD Self Service, Exchange Reporter, M365, Recovery, and SharePoint Manager Plus. All of these components you can take as a separate application or a separate product, or you can take a bundle product which is AD360. So let me introduce uh, each components for you. The first component, AD Manager Plus. By AD Manager Plus, you can manage Active Directory, M365, with different type of management. We have user management, computer management, group management, content management, mailbox management. You can take actions uh, from uh, AD360. Like you can create single user, uh, you can create bulk of users, reset password, unlock user, delete or edit or enable or disable users uh, in Active Directory from AD Manager Plus. Also, we have uh, default by default uh, reports and you can make custom or query or schedule report also we have a delegation and workflow and automation in ad manager plus after that we have ad audit ad audit you can audit ad or active directory azure file servers windows servers and workstation so you can track every change in your active directory and users groups gpo ou computers and you can get uh, reports and you can make alert to send alert to you as a notification and also we have more than 200 reports Okay, like we have here a uh, login report, you can see the login report is a failure uh, and why uh, this user can't, can't uh, log in. If this by bad password or bad username or any information for user, you can see the information. So also we have here a login activity, workstation activity, Okay, I will make sure you can hear me um, clear. Okay, that's great. Also, we have AD self service. AD Self Service Plus, it's uh, uh, contain two main points in AD360, which is uh, multi-factor authentication and also single sign-on. So by AD Self Service, you can get the user uh, to take action. Action like what? You can simplify password management with Self Service Password, like reset and uh, uh, reset the password, unlock account, self-update for the information, or change password. Also, we have multi-factor authentication for uh, applications, for endpoints, and also we have different methods or factors to make this multi-factor authentication. We have more than 19 different uh, ways to make this authentication. For example, we have Q&A, email verification, SMS. Also, we have a, a fingerprint or face ID to make this authentication. Exit change reporter plus. This is for reporting, auditing, monitoring, and also content search tools for exit change server for exit change online. So you can 
make a report uh, for your mailbox, uh, hidden mailbox, or any restriction in your mailbox, you can get the uh, uh, report. And also we have auditing, monitor, and content search in this mailbox. Also, you can see the email traffic or storage in your mailbox. After that, we have M360 uh, Manager Plus. This is for reporting and auditing and monitor. Also, we have delegation and automation for M365. You can make this management for Exchange Online or Azure or Microsoft Teams. So we have different type of uh, management, like shared mailbox management, uh, public uh, folder modification, uh, MDM, in Exchange Online, and also you can make a permission or change anything in Exchange Mail Mailbox, and also uh, you can make a configuration in your Exchange. After that, or finally, we have Recovery Manager Plus. Recovery Manager Plus uh, allow you to make uh, or take a backup for all the information in your system, so you can restore any object or any site or any information in Active Directory or Azure or Exchange, SharePoint, uh, Google Workspace, Zoho Work Drive. So you can take a, a, like a backup for all this information and you can restore this information anytime you want. So we discussed AD360, what is the main uh, features or uh, uh, main points uh, in AD360 and also the components uh, in AD360. You can take AD360 as bundle product or you can choose what is the specific components you need and what is the specific components match your requirements. That's all for today and we will be more than happy to offer you demo and POC for AD360 or for any uh, application or solution in Manage Engine, just contact us by this email. This is my personal email and sales email or by phone number. And we will contact you to answer your qu questions and also offering demo or POC. So if you have any question regarding our webinar or another question, please uh, write this question in Q&A and also we will uh, answer by email, inshallah. Okay, we will wait a while, a little while for your questions. Uh, if you have any question, please write it in Q&A and we contact you or answer now if we have time. Okay, thank you very much for your time uh, and uh, we are here uh, to, to help you anytime. You can uh, reach out by email or contact us by phone number or uh, from the webinar, uh, sorry, website. Yes, if you have uh, uh, need, uh, yes, this PowerPoint, I will send you uh, after the session, inshallah, by email and all the information to contact. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Assalamu alaikum.